Hey, what's up guys? Today I'll be doing game 486 of the Road to 384, so here we go. Alright, oh, stop and shop. Okay, I feel like... I, I, okay, I was going to say New York. I was going to say I thought that was an East Coast kind of thing. So we're probably in New York. I'm seeing a ton of New York plates. Um. Oh, wait a second. I think we've been here before, not too long ago, in fact. I think this is in Albany. Hold on. Is this where I think it is? Oh, no. the This would be going north and south. I'm just going crazy. Um, for, Yeah, forget what I said. Let's keep going east for now. Uh, either way, though, this is looking more like upstate, I'd have to say. What does that say? At Westchester. Okay, I take that back. We're in Westchester County. So that means we're in the New York area. And let's see. Oh, City of Peekskill. Oh, I've been to Peekskill before. Okay, cool. Uh, we got Conklin Avenue here, and we don't know what this one is yet. I guess it could be Highway 6. We're by the Bear Mountain Parkway. And it is Highway 6. Look at that. Wow. So I've been on this road before. That's pretty cool. So long ago, though, I don't remember it that well. <laughs> I mean, I've been on this road a lot, the Bear Mountain Road, but I don't remember this as much. Okay, so here's the parkway over here, and here's the stop and shop. And yes, Peekskill is in Westchester County, so we are in the New York area, just on the far northern end. Alright, round two. Um, this is looking like Florida or California. I gotta say California, though, because of the front plates. And uh, probably LA or San Francisco. We got East 7th Street and G Avenue. Alright, so let's go west on 7th Street here. What does that say? Oh, never mind. Alright, but yeah, let's go west on 7th Street. I mean, uh, yeah, everything about this is looking California, I've gotta say. And uh, I guess let's go south here. Because I think it said we're north of whatever. Downtown, Chamber of Commerce, City Hall, Historic Downtown, San Ysidro. Is that the name of the place we're at? I'm not sure I've heard of that, but I guess let's head closer to the city. Why not? What does this say? National City. Is that just the name of the city? That's an odd name. Um, I guess it is. Let's see. And we got Highway 5 here. Let's see, can we jump on the highway? It's always nice when we can jump on the highway. And we can. Alright, good. And this is exit 11B, or does that say 118? It says 11B, so we're in San Diego. Gonna be in San Diego in a couple weeks. It'll be my first time in California and the West Coast, so I'm pretty excited for that. Uh, let's see. So we're by um, we're by that National City. So are we by downtown San Diego then? I see the letter streets like we saw before. Let's see. What exits this over here? 15B. So we're a bit further south. And uh, let's see. Here's the National City. We're on 8th Street. And I think we start on 5th or 6th. Let's go back to the start. And I'm glad I clicked before anything else. Alright, so 7th Street and G Avenue. Alright, let's find that. And then we'll be all good to go. So National City is an actual city. Interesting. Alright, so we're right about there. Alright, there we go. 10 yards away in the San Diego area. Okay, round three. Interesting bridge here. Uh, the trees are making it look kind of Midwestern. Uh, let's see what we got for license plates. That looks like a Maryland plate, actually, with the red on the bottom left. I believe there's a U.S. flag down there. So this is Odell Road, and this is Cypress Road over here. And yeah, it does not look very Midwestern anymore. And yeah, there's another Maryland plate, so we've seen both variants now. Um, what does that say? Beltsville, Maryland. 
Well, that's good to see. All right. Um, should we try looking for where Beltsville is? It must be like a Baltimore, D.C. suburb, I'm thinking. Well, here's a main road here. Um, do we know which one it is? That's the question. Hmm. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what we got. All right, Maryland 200. And we're by 95 and 270, so it's probably Baltimore then. Or no, it's actually DC. All right, where's Beltsville at? And then where's 200? It's up here. Okay, are we seeing a Beltsville any, anywhere at all? What road is this, by the way? Because that's something we're also we also kind of need to know. Because I'm not too sure right now. And it looks like we're, it's going to be a while before we find out. Alright, so here's 200 up here. Yeah, like it said, it's taking us to 95 and 270. And I can't tell if this is a state high. Oh, it's US 1. Okay. That'll be over here then. Yeah, and here's Odell Road. There's Beltsville. So we're going to have to check and see if this is part of the Baltimore or D.C. area. So is this Grant up here? Cyprus, that's right. Oh, uh, where's that at? Did we miss it? Hmm. Oh, we we're much closer than I thought. Alright, so let's take a look at where this would be geographically. And the big maps, and yeah, I found out it has a dark mode, so that'll be better. Because who doesn't love dark mode? We all love dark mode. Okay, so... Let's see. So here's Beltsville. So yeah, it's uh, adjacent to D.C. So we are in the D.C. area. Very nice. Okay, so D.C. for round three. And now we're on to round four in a suburban area. And this is almost looking like a New England suburb. Or something. That, you know what? I'll just say east. Because if it's not New England, it's probably like Atlanta or something. Yeah, we're heading south right now. Got like these McMansion style houses. Um, let's see. What do we got here? Don't know what that logo is. Is that another Maryland plate? Can't tell. Hmm. Yeah, not too sure. Oh, no, that's a New Hampshire plate. Okay, see, that's what I was thinking. New Hampshire suburb now as we always ask will this be boston or manchester there's colonel daniels driving it's going to be tough to get a 5k on this one i'll try going east here see if that gives us any luck see if we could even find out the name of this road that'll be nice because as of right now i'm not too sure let's just make sure we're actually in new hampshire that one actually kind of looked like a Rhode Island plate. Okay, that one's New Hampshire. Let's see what the bus says, actually. Bedford School District. Is there a Bedford, New Hampshire? Um, Let's see. Yes, there is. It's actually in Manchester, so... Or I should say in Hillsborough County. So that's good to see. Um... Now we just got to figure out what the name of this road is, and we should be all good to go. All right, we got another road up here, and this is Beals Road. So let's see if we can find a Beals Road. Anywhere at all. Hmm. The problem with all these roads is they kind of just spur off to wherever. So I'm not sure if we're actually looking in the right area or not. Oh, wait a second. Jenkins, never mind. I thought I saw an Amherst for some reason. Uh, I'll keep going east then, if assuming we are in Bedford, so that means we're west of Manchester.
But yeah, some of these New Hampshire suburbs are so remote, it's crazy. Alright, now we got Wallace Road. And I think I've got to start heading south. Are we seeing a Wallace Road anywhere? Let's see, let's go back up to Bedford. Because we kind of strayed away from that. Yes, here's a Wallace Road. Okay, good. And here's Beals, look at that. There's Colonel Daniels. So now, with where we started, uh, we're kind of going east. And there's a break in between the houses. Okay, let's think about this. Let's not blow it. Let's see, is there another house down here? Yes. Alright, I think this is where we're at. And it is! Alright, we got the 5k. And we are in the Manchester area. Alright, now we got round five. It's Old Forge Drive and what does that say? Heatherford Drive. Um, let's see. What am I thinking here? It looks like it could be southern with the brick and stuff. And now this is Knightswood. Let's see, are there any plates we can pick up on? Not really. I guess they could be Virginia plates since they look plain and white. Um, let's see. What about over here? Actually, that looks kind of like North Carolina to me. Um, so it could be that. Hmm. Uh, question is, are we going to find a main road or not? It's Windy Rust, it said. Oh, what's this over here? Here we go. This will be our main road. Old Providence. And yeah, we got no front plates, so that would make sense for North Carolina. Oh, Windy Rush, not Windy Rust. Okay, so this is Re Road. Let's try going west. I don't know why, I'm feeling west. I think that'll work out. Clearly, clearly in a very suburban part of whatever city we're in. And the road ends here. This Colony Road, and look at this, we're in Charlotte. And I've got to say, it has been a long time since we've been in Charlotte. Like, it quickly became one of the most underrepresented metros out there. Like, it's been seen at 11 or 12, I don't remember which one exactly, for the longest time. And it's well over 100 games, so it's good to see we're finally landed in Charlotte again. <clears throat> Which is pretty much what you'd expect when landing in North Carolina, if we're being honest. Now the question would be, how close are we to the city? Calvary Church. This is Pineville Matthews Road. And it's a state highway, so that helps. And it's Highway 51. And then this was, re oh, this was also re-road, interesting. Alright, so let's head over to Charlotte then. Find Highway 51. Let's see, where would that be? Here it is. So we're in the southern part of the city. Here's Re Road. Araya? I don't know. You gotta tell me, because I'm. I don't go to Charlotte. I don't know anything about Charlotte. Alright, so it was Old Forge and then the. Heatherford. That's right. And here it is. Alright, two yards away and we were in Charlotte. Okay, so there we go. Round one was New York, round two was San Diego, round three was DC, round four was Manchester, and round five was Charlotte. Okay, so we were in New York for the 183rd time. And then we were down in, oh, whoops, hold on. Okay, and then we were in San Diego for the 20th time, 4th California Metro to hit 20 or more. And then round three, we were over in D.C. for the 51st time. And then round four was up in Manchester for the 16th time. 
And then to finish it off, round five was in Charlotte, and that's the 13th time there. And that will complete game 486. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.